everyone, welcome, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So for this video, I'm actually gonna be going and getting my belly button pierced. So I'm very excited. I'm actually I'm actually not that nervous. Like I'll probably be nervous when I'm in the actual place, but right now I'm really not that nervous at all actually. Um this is what my belly button looks like currently. It's just a normal looking belly button, I guess. I've not actually gotten I've not gotten any, but I've also not got an LC, so I don't know if they're gonna be able to because like there's not much like skin to grab. But yeah, this is the before. I'm gonna go right now. Oh my gosh. When I filmed that intro, I didn't actually think I was gonna be getting it done. Me and my friend Millie have always talked about getting our belly button pierced. But I've always been a bit like, oh, I don't know whether I should or not. Because, like, I don't know if it would look good on me and suit me. She decided she does want the hers definitely doing. So she messaged me a few days ago and she was like, um, I'm gonna get my belly button pierced. Can you come with me? And so I was like, yeah, sure, whatever. I kind of considered, like, maybe I should get mine done. I didn't want to get it done whilst I was unsure. It, last night, I was, like, looking at, like, Pinterest pictures and everything. And I've always, always, since I was younger, like, always wanted one. But, like I said, I've always had my doubts. So I'm more of, like, a gold person. So, like, as you can see, like, I wear basically all gold jewellery. I never really wear silver. I wear, like, diamantes. Like, you know, I've got diamantes and stuff. But my... Out of silver and gold, I wear gold because it just suits me better, I feel like. Most places, it'd be a surprise if you could get your belly button pierced with the gold because most places will only pierce it with silver because it's, like, cleaner and safer for, like, when you first get it pierced, if that makes sense. So, obviously, to get pierced with silver and then have to, like, leave it and let it heal so I can then change it would then be a long time having it silver. And, honestly, that would just annoy me, having, like, gold jewellery and then a silver belly button piercing so this morning i was going with the view of if i can get it pierced with gold then i'll get it done if, if i can only get it pierced with silver then i'm not going to get it done because it would annoy me like clashing with like the jewelry every day that i wear because as well i thought because like earrings and stuff it usually takes six to nine weeks before you can then change it so i was like six to nine weeks is a long time so when i turned up i asked the person can i get it pierced with gold and she said no she showed me the only options that they do which is basically silver so i was like right Mm, that's not great but then she said to me that you can change it after three weeks of getting it done which is literally amazing so i was like oh my word yes like because i don't think three weeks is that long let's be real i think that will go by so fast and then i'll be able to change it to gold i got it done i'm going to insert the footage now of me getting it done and also my friend millie getting it done and then i'll answer questions and everything about it in case you're getting it done or you're just curious <laughs> Me getting it done and um, i would show it you but it's currently got a plaster on it but you might be able to see it a bit in the video but i've not even seen what it looks like because if i just show it look it's got a plaster on it which i've got to keep on it for 24 hours this video is going to be like a two-day video because i'll probably explain a bit more about it and everything tomorrow and show it you and everything like that and i'll show my reaction of actually looking at it myself i'm gonna like answer a couple of questions and everything because i've been considering getting it done for ages and finally got it done and i know myself i had a lot of questions the first question I'm gonna answer is did it hurt because I feel like that's like the most common question no it actually didn't like so obviously I got it done with my friend Millie Millie said that it didn't hurt but just like when they clamped it that bit hurt but the actual needle didn't I honestly don't think it hurt at all really like don't get me wrong I felt like it was uncomfortable and didn't really hurt though. It was just like a bit uncomfortable. Like it just felt a bit weird, but it didn't hurt. On a scale of one to 10, 10 being excruciating pain and one being like, didn't feel a thing. I'd probably say it's like a four or less. Like I wouldn't say it's any more than a four. I can hardly even remember it getting done. Another question is how much was it? Um, it was only 28 pound, which I think is brilliant. Like I think that is really good because I was going to view of that like 40 pound is pretty reasonable for it. My Helix piercing, that was 45 pound. So I was thinking, 
and at the same place I got this one so I was thinking a belly button piercing is like more extreme kind of than a little ear piercing it was only £28 like only £28 which I think is amazing compared to what I was like imagining the next question is how I'm going to clean it so I'm going to you can buy like the aftercare stuff at your piercing shop so I'm just going to clean it with this which is just like ear piercing no after piercing lotion which I already have this anyway from my seconds and I then used it on my helix and i'm just going to use it on my belly button as well there are like other questions about how it heals and everything like that and like the healing process but obviously i can't answer because i literally got it done like two hours ago but i can keep you updated in other videos and everything so if you want to subscribe then you'll be able to see those i'm quite happy i get it done because when i wear like low-waisted cargoes and everything like that i always just feel like there's something missing so i just feel like a little belly button piercing would look really cute but yeah i'm not gonna lie it will 100 annoy me that i've got a silver belly button with like all my gold jewelry but it's only three weeks of annoyance i'm gonna see you tomorrow when i remove the plaster hey guys okay so it is now the next day it's actually the evening now so it's been a bit over 24 hours i did end up removing the plaster yesterday because i was far too impatient so i have seen what it looks like but not properly if that makes sense um so anyway i had to put on a new plaster because that one was really hurting like it was really pulling on my skin but anyway, i'm going to take off the plaster now this is what it looks like once again with the plaster oh my gosh i can see it ouch it kind of hurts not the belly one hits in the plaster this is what it looks like. I'm just gonna give it a bit of clean so there's not like blood around it. To be fair, there's literally basically no blood on it. I feel like it looks like there's blood on it because you can see there a little purple dot which kind of looks like blood but it's not. It's where she like marked it to actually pierce it. This is the final result. And to be fair, I actually do really like the piercing that it got pierced with. Despite me saying how I didn't want it to be silver and it is silver, I actually do like it. Like, I do think it looks really pretty. I am really pleased with it and I do really like it and I feel like it look really cute when I wear like my low rise cargoes and everything. So I'm quite excited. Make sure you give this video a like because I've also got a lot of extra uploads planned um, because like suddenly I'm on my YouTube game like what? So if you want to know when they'll be coming out then make sure you click the notification bell when you subscribe to my channel so you'll be actually notified when I do upload an extra video. I love you all so so much and I'll see you guys in my brand new video next Saturday. Bye!